Shaz Chowdhury, Pep Talk UK, joined by the unbeaten Felix Cash. How are you doing, Felix? Not too bad, mate, you? Looking kind of comfortable there, pal. I ain't got no choice, have I? I'm just chilling out, mate. <laughs> Stuck indoors, lockdown, isn't it, mate? Lockdown in a hotel room, you bubbled up. Bubbled up, mate, and I. Um, the lads treating you well from Queensbury, Frank, Devs. Yeah, listen, they've been, they've been, they've been all right so far. They've so, been all right so far. <laughs> you had a face oh. off Denzel Bentley. Yeah. Um, how how do you think the presser went? Yeah, it went all right. Listen, it's presser, isn't it? He brought the the old sparring come up again. Oh man, I've never heard more more talk about a, a, a shitty two rounds of a life. <laughs> <laughs> but um, listen, it was uh, a long time ago. Listen, trying to build the fight, and it's just try to talk about something. Um, all your fights have been on matchroom card so far. Frank Queensbury, they've won this. Has it even played on your mind at all? Has it come into play at all for you? Not really. Listen, it's um, both of us are in the, in the boxing ring, and we it's a fight at the end of the day, and um, it's gonna get stuck in, and we. Both you and Denzel have talked about levels in this. Um, I've got a feeling whatever happens come fight night, I reckon you two are going to do it again. Yeah? Yeah, I think so. I think you're both... I know you both have aspirations to move on. Well, who knows? You may even do it as a world title fight one day. You never know, mate. You never know. He's a good lad. You're a good lad. How do you see fight night going? I believe I'll get him out of there uh, within the 12 rounds. Listen, he's, uh, he's, um, that's what I believe. Um, I've seen him pictures of you. You're in terrific shape. Um, good camp. You've got your hair done. No spray tan? <laughs> <laughs> no, I've led off the sunbeds, man. I ain't, had, I ain't had as many sunbeds now, but um, it's a bit of lockdown, isn't it? Sparring for this camp, who have you been sparring? Yeah, I've sparred quite a few different people. Um, we've done a good bit of sparring with Craig Richards. Um, Jimmy Staines is down the gym. Done a few rounds. I know John Ryder now and again. A few rounds with um, quite a few different people. There's so many to name. There's a lot of people coming to help me out. Do you feel added pressure? Like, obviously, Connor's got a fantastic result, got rid of his opponent in the round. Is there, like, amongst you boys at the matchroom gym, is there added pressure on each other? No, nah, not really, no. Nah. There's no other pressure, no. Nah. It's just, you know, everyone's, everyone's in their own, in their own, um, in their own weight divisions, in their own fights. And, listen, I'm buzzing for all of them. They've done really, really well. I'm just um, keep the run going now. I remember when you got the Commonwealth strap, you were buzzing. It was really important to you. Then you've defended it twice, once in fight camp. How important is the British for you? Because you could have, not using the word ducked, but you could have gone a different route. But you went, no, I want this fight. I want that title. How important is the Lonsdale belt for you? It's very important. Listen, it's a, it's a title that I've always wanted to win since I've was since i started boxing. So, you know, um, it's you know it's, it's one that I want to win and say that I've won and um, move on afterwards. Um, you already got, you're already 1-0 over Queensbury today with your... After the face-off, you left Frank hanging. I heard it was a cheeky <laughs> little something that you you were going to get something from Eddie Earn for doing that. I didn't even re- <laughs> no, I didn't even realise I'd done that. I um, I didn't even realise I'd done that. I didn't see um Frank put his hand out. I shook yeah, Denzel. You were in the zone, weren't you? You were. I was in the yeah. zone. I wasn't even looking at Frank. To be honest, you never know. Looking, shook hands, and then like Frank, you left. Yeah, him nah, hanging. Nah. Nah. I think it looks it looked for us what it was because I didn't I didn't um. I didn't see it, man. I haven't had a chance to jump on socials, but I'm gonna and have a little look around and see if it's if there's any memes on it at the moment. But I'll WhatsApp them to you in a bit. <laughs> yeah, what's up, Mo? me. Well, thank you for giving us your time. Um, we wish you the best of luck come fight night. If there's anyone you want to shout at, now's your chance. Nah, listen, I want to do um just shout listen all my team, Tony and that, you know, for, for getting me ready for this fight and um you know all the sponsors, all my sponsors on board, you know, just um help me for this fight. And if if you get a bonus from Eddie for leaving him hanging, you have to come back on and let I us know. I should get a bonus, really, shouldn't I? Well, you want, <laughs> I? I've only got a watch. I reckon you'll get at least 
at least a yacht for doing that. <laughs> Why we play maps? <laughs> yeah, that's it. <laughs> nice one. See, let's enjoy your time in the camp and in the bubble, and we'll catch up with you post fight. All right, buddy. Here's my top line.